Hi, welcome to my channel. In this video I'd like to show you an alternative way of uh, connecting the lighting circuit. Basically, just imagine you've got the ceiling rows in one room and in another room you don't want to have the ceiling rows, you just want you just want to have spotlights, downlights, like six downlights or you know whatever. So basically, just imagine this this bit is a is a f in one room. So obviously, there's the ceiling cross connection. There's the cable from the other room or consumer unit going into this ceiling cross, and then obviously spit here for for the switch for the light fittings, and this cable is going to another room. In this room, we we don't want any ceiling rows. We just want um, spotlights. So this cannot be on the ceiling because how it will look. So as you see, this cable is just twin inert. So the neutral is connected to the neutral terminal in the ceiling rows. The light is connected to loop, and then goes to another room, but not to the ceiling. It just goes straight to the switch. This is the metal box for the switch. Here's the switch. So all the connection is made in the switch, and this cable just go to the from the switch to the spotlights. So how it's connected here? So as you see in this box, <coughs> the neutral wires from both of these cables are linked together by WIGO switch and they are just hidden in the box behind the switch plate. Then the two earthing conductors from both of these cables are linked together and connected to the earthing terminal and now we've got just these two wires permanent life from the last ceiling rows <coughs> so we need to connect it to the Com terminal in one way switch and then the switch life which goes to our down lights we connect to the L1 terminal. So here permanent life, here the switch life. So this is the connection. So we've got neutral took from neutral terminal from the ceiling rows from the last room, then it goes to our switch and link together with the neutral that goes straight to our set of lights then permanent life took from the loop by this cable go to COM terminal in one way switch and then from L1 goes through this cable to our set of lights and two adding conductors are just linked together and connected to the earthing terminal in a box. So this cable in the ceiling goes to first spotlight. Everything okay, but in this arrangement we don't have any connection to another light in another room. So there's three options how you can connect another cable that goes to another room. So one, you can try to push neutral, another neutral to a neutral terminal in this ceiling rows and live to loop in this ceiling rows or you can uh, make a junction box on this cable somewhere in the ceiling but this has to be accessible and then from this split this, this cable to another room or you can, and I think this is the easiest you can push, put the cable into this switch and just make all the connections in here. So the WIGO is three, three way, so you can connect another neutral in here. Then the permanent life is in common, 
So let's unscrew it. You link these two together. And you need just one small bit of wire. So you need to link it. You need to take permanent from this wire connector and connect to common. Remember you need to have quite deep back box so you can fit all of this together and also the switch can close easily.